Hello everyone. So I tweeted yesterday if you guys wanted to see a summer haul video because I got some new things and I'm super excited about it. I'm glad you guys want to see this video and here it is. And by the way, you're probably looking at my her and you're like, girl, so what had happened was I had dyed it. I don't know if you guys remember like about a month ago when my hair was like kind of like this color. So basically it faded. So in my previous video, when you saw that blonde color, that's what it faded to, which I really liked. But then at the same time, I wanted to go a little more ashy. So that's why she has to put a gray toner over it and eventually this will all fade. But for now, I really like how interesting this is as well. Okay, so the last time I did a haul was my spring haul, which was almost three months ago. Long overdue, it's time to show you guys some new things I got, so let's just get started. Oh my god, you guys, this I am so, so excited to tell you guys about because I have wanted this bike for seriously, like, so long. And that is a public bike. Yes, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Public, but this is a very popular brand here in San Francisco. My previous bike is this really crappy bike that I got for super cheap. It was really cute and all, but it just started having so many problems. So I was like, you know what? It's time to upgrade. But yeah, I wanted to start biking more because for one, I feel like it saves gas. It's good for the environment. And also it is very good exercise. So that is why I decided to invest in a new bike. This bike finally went on sale and I recently bought it. It's gonna be here in like seven days. I'm gonna go on so many adventures. So be sure to follow me on Instagram if you guys wanna see that. So the bike I got is by Public, of course, and it is the V7i, which is the 2014 model and it's actually getting discontinued, I believe. I got it in the red color. It's a diamond frame, which is new for me. I'm used to more of the step through Dutch bikes, but um, yeah, I'm so, excited for this and I got so excited that I had went on Amazon and bought myself this big basket. Wa keeps laughing about how crazy this basket is. It's huge and the reason I got this is because I know that I'm gonna start biking to buy my groceries and things like that and I needed a decent sized basket, okay? I was reading reviews and people said you can fit two um, grocery bags in here and also I can put my dog in here like <laughs> How cute is that gonna be? It's gonna come in very, very handy. I'm, ugh, I'm so excited. Okay, calm down. Now let's move on and talk about the clothing items I got. So shout out to Boohoo for these clothing items because they did reach out to me and ask if I wanted to do a summer haul. They would send me some items and I can show you guys and hopefully some of the items catches your eye. But um, yeah, I have a few items that I wanted to show you guys. And the good thing about Boohoo is that they're very affordable. Everything I got, I believe is under $100. Their price range is like between $5 to $40, which is super cheap nowadays because clothes are getting more and more expensive. It's kind of crazy. If you guys are looking for a fun, affordable clothing brand, I highly recommend Boohoo.com. They have a ton of stuff that's perfect for summer, beach day essentials, or just bathing suits and things like that, which I actually have a few cute bathing suits. Like these are the first cute bathing suits I've ever had in my life because I have always just had just not cute bathing suits. I don't know why. Let me just show you. First one is this one. This is my first white bathing suit. Look at this sexiness, girl. I don't know, I've never had a white bathing suit. I think white just looks so pretty on everyone. So this is what it looks like. It has these strappity, strappity things on top. And on the back, it's just like this. It's just elastic. These are also padded, which is good for those girls who, you know, lack in that department, <laughs> me. And let me show you the bottoms. This is just what the bottoms look like. A nice bottom triangular bikini bottom. And then the next bathing suit I got, this one I really like. I love a classic black bathing suit. So this one you have a tie that goes over your neck and then the back is just a strap. This strap right here that's down the center, you can actually wrap it around your body so that it has that extra like strap that goes around that I think is really cute. I also feel like it makes your torso look a little bit longer. So I really like this bathing suit. It also is padded. Yes, thank you for being so considerate and remembering the padding because there are so many bathing suits that have no padding inside and I'm over here like putting band-aids on my nips. For the bottoms, this one is kind of different from the white one. It is the triangular shape, but I like that on the side there is this little cutout. So. That's what it looks like. For anyone that lives in the Bay Area, can we just appreciate for a moment that the San Francisco weather has been good. For the past week, it has been so warm, which hallelujah, finally. The next thing, since I'm on the topic of bathing suits, 
Here I have a beach bag. Yes, we all need beach bags, especially if you take your dog to the beach. You know, you need a whole lot of stuff. So this is just a beach bag I got from Boohoo. Here's the pattern on it. It also has this rope handle, just a really ginormous bag. Like you can put your towel, your, um, your snacks. It can fit so much in here. There's also this compartment right over here so you can put your cell phone just in case, you know, something gets wet in here. And for the closure, it is a button that is just magnetic. So there you have it. I also picked out a swimsuit cover up. I like the floral prints on it. It's super long. It goes down to like a little bit past my knee. I chose this one out because I feel like you can wear it with a summer dress as well. So it's not just like a beach cover up type of kimono. And here I also got this simple black dress. I feel like everyone needs a black maxi over the summer. So foolproof. You can wear your bathing suit under it. And overall, it's just a nice, comfortable thing that you can just throw on and go. If you have a floppy hat, I think floppy hats and maxis are so cute. It has these spaghetti straps and it's just super long, goes down to about my knees the fabric is really really soft it feels like PJs right at the bottom you will see that it's all different lengths I don't know what this style is called if you guys know let me know in the comments but I like it because it's not just flat and with that dress I paired it with these sandals these sandals are also from boohoo they are super comfortable they have two buckles so you have this one up here for your ankles and then this is the other one that just wraps around like the bottom of your foot. Very true to size and they're also super cheap so that's good. And another pair of shoes I picked up. Oh my goodness. I have been looking for a pair of shoes like this for so long. At first I didn't know what to expect in these shoes because you just never know if these are comfortable but these are surprisingly very cushiony. Like they are super soft. This chunky heel makes it super easy to walk in. Overall I just really like these shoes. They're so cute. Like I could just picture wearing, I don't know, like either boyfriend jeans or maybe like a summer dress to go along with these. So those are the items I chose from Boohoo. They are also doing a $500 clothing giveaway. So I will leave a link down below if you guys want to check that out. And now for some beauty items. Throughout the summer, I didn't buy a lot of makeup because I had a lot of makeup to use up anyway, but there were a few things that were super hyped up that I decided to purchase and try out. First one being this Elsie foundation. I don't know if I talked about this already yet, but this is the foundation that I've been using pretty much every day of summer now. And I have it in the shade Sand. If you're looking for something as full coverage as the Hourglass Immaculate, then this is not the same thing. But overall, I still really like it for a summer foundation because it's very natural looking like you seriously don't even feel it on your skin so I would definitely recommend you guys to try it out if you're looking for a good summer foundation But if you're looking something for like picture day or just a party a wedding or something Then this is not my super go-to and then the next thing is a face wash This is the Josie Marin Argan creamy oil cleansing treatment I've been really into using oils or creams to remove my makeup because I found that they work the best. Maybe because it's so emollient, is that the word? It just melts everything off. And this seriously melts everything off. And after I use this, I feel like it makes my skin glow. Like my skin feels so supple. This also came with a muslin cloth that I find is very crucial to using this product because it is pretty oily. But the good thing about it, even though it's oily, it's not gonna make you break out. It's not that type of like, heavy, greasy, oily. It, the muslin cloth is very essential because I used other cloths before to try to wipe off the oil and I still feel like the residue is there. So with the cloth that it comes with, it really helps take everything off. Now let's get a little personal. During the summertime, I think we all sweat a little more and that is just unavoidable. So I really like using panty liners over the summer because it just makes me feel fresh. Like whenever you get sweaty, you just take off the panty liner and replace it with a new one and you just feel all like a new woman again. I've tried seriously almost every panty liner out there and I would have to say, although Kotex be expensive, they are the best ones. Like these are the ones that don't slip off and like get shriveled up down there, you know what I mean. I really like these because they really stay put I did the math and they're like 10 cents each. So every single time you throw one away, that's 10 cents. Kind of pricey. Mm -hmm. Because other panty liners average 4 cents each. Yes, I did the math when I was on Target. Okay, don't judge me. This panty liner stays put and it absorbs well as well. So 
shout out to you Kotex. Lastly, you guys know my love for San Francisco and when I came across this book when I was in anthropology, I had to go on Amazon because everything is cheaper on Amazon and I had to pick it up. This book is called See San Francisco and it is by Victoria Smith. I got this book as a coffee table book not knowing that I would really, really enjoy it. So if you're new to San Francisco or you're trying to move here or maybe you are coming here to vacation, I really recommend each and every one of you to go and get this book on Amazon because it breaks down every single district in San Francisco. In the table of contents, it shows you all the different districts in San Francisco, like it really breaks it down for you. And when you go through the pages, it's basically a picture book and it really just shows the character of each district. So that's what I really love about it. Because of this book, I feel like I know more about each district and which one I really like to hang out in and because this book is just really pretty and colorful to have on your coffee table. Okie dokie, so that is it to this summer haul. I feel like this summer I have really been enjoying it so far. I feel like this year has been a year of changes for me. Like for one, moving to San Francisco has really changed the way I look at many different things, if that makes sense. Like have you ever moved or been to a new place or just been on vacation and it just completely changes your perspective of life? Okay, it's kind of weird, it's kind of dramatic, but it's true. Ever since I've been here, I've been adapting to a more like urban lifestyle, I feel like, which is what inspired me to really start biking, which is why I got my, you know, beautiful bike that's gonna be here in a few days. I've just been having such a good summer. I hope that you guys are having a great one as well. Be sure to check the link down below if you guys want a chance to win $500 to shop on boohoo.com. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Enjoy your summer, spend time outdoors, watch Netflix if you want to, and I will see you all in a later video. Bye! She just wants to like cling on to me. Michi. Can you guys see that? Hey mom. This is what she's doing. Hey mom. Such a baby.